But now I know without a job that... Uh, I object. Don't fucking ugly cry. Yo, what's cracking, guys? You read that title correctly. Kara and Guillermo's Wedding. Oh, boy. Like I say for every episode of this, this show needs drama. It's built on drama. There better be drama at this. If it's just a good wedding, I'm gonna be pissed. Let's find out. But before I do, this is sponsored by you guys. You guys over on patreon.com slash wineboxpoppy. You guys help make it possible because YouTube hates swears, dude. That's why every YouTuber like mutes or bleeps out the swears because YouTube demonetizes every video instantly. It's a really good time. <laughs> I like swears. It would be inauthentic if I was like, what the heck is going on here? So if you want to support and fight back against the swears, patreon.com slash wineboxpoppy. Let's see if I'm worth it. You all met on this journey by chance today. He looks like he's running for school president as a Republican and also going to a baptism. You become one and families are united. At this time, I'm going to start with Kara. The fucking Zoom people? Get, come on, why, dude, just not go. First of all, it's being taped. Second of all, why'd you show that? Like, are people sitting around sipping wine talking to the fucking laptop? God, that would be insufferable. I would have to jerk off. Thank you. <laughs> Guillermo, or in English version, Guillermo. Uh, wrong two times, bitch, it's Guillermo. God, don't you see the fucking L's? <laughs> <laughs> I used to think that we had met randomly. By chance? No, 90 Day Fiance probably picked him out for you, to be honest. I will bet you fucking anything that they have done that before. That they have set up couples or they have foreigners ready to go with U.S. citizens. Guaranteed. Remember, their business depends on it. Like the people on the hoarders, like the Asian lady who would go through the trash, she was an actor. But now I know, without a doubt, that... Uh, I object. Don't fucking ugly cry. It's okay. I'm not. Um, um, now I know without a doubt that the universe put you in front of me because we're meant to spend our lives together. I stand here today. Your ex chick has some big ass titties. <laughs> At a wedding, there's always that one chick with just her tits out. You're like, whoa, there's family here. I'm not complaining. I'm just saying. I have to talk about them. You brought them. I'm completely humbled and thankful for the love and life that we've created in our relationship. And I'm incredibly excited for the love and life I know that we'll build from this day forward. She's crying because now she can't just fuck guys. She's not a party girl anymore. She's now a housewife. I'm sure she will fill that role very well. <sighs> I bet you he's not going to cry because I wouldn't either. And I bet you him seeing her cry feels a, like a little bit good. He's like, yeah, that's how much you care, bitch. Yeah. Because that's what I would be thinking. <laughs> I'd be like, wow, you really do, huh? Watch me straight face this thousand yard stare. I'm not even gonna look you in the eyes. I'll look right fucking through you. Yeah. Yo, the cameraman knows what he's doing. He's like, oh, she's clapping? <laughs> Retake. We need, we need to get her clapping. Because when she claps, it claps twice. And now for Guillermo. Oh, the pussy's already crying. Dude, this looks like it's your first communion. Grow up. My queen. Well, she's like, yes, king. Oh, dude, she even rolled her fucking eyes back, too. She's like, I hate this guy. This guy is corny as shit. If I can't start off my wedding vows with my bitch, it's not happening. I love you with all my heart. I'm proud that we finally made it. Yeah, 90 days, wow. I know it's been longer, but that's the title of the show. <laughs> yeah. Knowing that my brother love you. Why would you show the Zoom call again, especially if one of the cunt's faces are blurred out, dude? One fifth of the people you can't legally show, yet <laughs> you do it twice. Aside from what we're doing right now, there is no point in watching a wedding. How else are you gonna try and fuck the girl with the big tits? You gonna holler at her from Zoom? From your iPhone 6S Plus AO? I don't know what you say to women. Uh, you like Newports? Huh? So much. I love you like a sister. <laughs> Just kidding, yo, that's kinda hot. Anybody else hard? 
fills my heart and that of all my family. Oh, it's his stupid fucking family, of course. Okay, now I get now Now it makes sense. I mean, three times showing them doesn't. The ones after saying family does. Now it, because they can't be there. Because they don't give a shit. They don't care about you, Guillermo. And neither do I. He looks like he runs and flip-flops to the ice cream truck. I promise to love you, adore you, always, so that we can achieve our dreams. Achieve. Achieve. You nailed it. Oh, I'm glad she corrected him, because I was like, what the fuck did he just say? Was that just my American ears being racist, or did he not say a word? Ah, good to know he can't fucking read. I mean, he did, he did read all of it except for the one word, but deport him. Good. <laughs> Do you, Guillermo, knowing the love that Kara has for you and returning it, do you take of this day? <laughs> this bitch doing the sign of the cross, that's hilarious. Also, it's just a wedding. There's nothing happening. Stupid fucking vows. Everybody's heard these. No drama. What's the point? How is this going to draw in people to watch the full-length hour show? Is it an hour? I've, no, I've never watched it. To be your lawfully wedded wife. I do. And Kara, knowing the love that Guillermo has for you and returning it, do you take him this day to be your lawfully wedded husband? Oh, what's she going to say? I do. By the authority vested in me by the current of Virginia, I do pronounce you husband and wife. And Guillermo, you may kiss your bride. Oh, uh, what is this feeling? Oh, God, it's like when I'm hearing music that isn't rap, it makes me angry. I don't want to see happiness. Stop this gay shit. Somebody hit somebody. Where's Pedro when you need him? What'd you say? <laughs> Leave the cute relationship shit at home. Never fucking do that again, okay? That was a terrorist attack. That was my 9-11. Estamos casados! We did it. We did it. I love so you. Good. Again, <laughs> with the happiness. I just love knowing that they have to contractually fight during this show eventually. She's also a bitch. Oh, it's over. Oh, darn. All I really collected from that was I still hate her, but I would fuck her. But isn't that how it usually goes? <laughs> okay, well, do you guys agree that the show needs drama, right? Because that, like nothing, literally nothing happened. You could read the title and go, okay, I imagined it. A lot less kissing in my head. However, I do like bridal porn, so I am bricked up. <laughs> okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you. If you want to see some more of this shit, I do stand-up comedy over at uh, youtube.com slash markkarski. I do a series called The Comedian, which follows like me doing open mics to the fucking top, and it's not as bad as it used to be. So if you want to see that, go over there. But if you don't want to, uh, like, share, comment, subscribe. Let's keep that algorithm going, baby. I love you. Mwah.